Hi everyone, I hope you're all well. Uh, welcome to HSP 404 in Semester 2, 2017. Hi, I'm Angie Dwyer. I'm your unit coordinator for this unit this semester. I think I've met most of you before, so you'll know about me and what I do and all of that sort of stuff. Um, and this unit is a, can be a bit of a hard one for folks. So I thought I would start by putting up a quick welcome video. And then I'm also going to put up a video um, that talks a little bit more about the assessment for you so you can think through it and all of that sort of stuff. But I'll do that in the next couple of weeks. So if you need to get in touch with me anytime, the best way to get in touch with me is definitely via my email. You can also find me on my mobile number though. Uh, if you need to get in touch urgently, that's in the notice on the front page of the site, the Milo site for HSP 404 for you. If you ever want to drop in and chat, um, I'm on Sandy Bay campus in the Social Sciences building on level 5 in room 534. But it's always a good idea to uh, call or email and arrange a time to catch up. I do have a set student consultation time though from 10 to 12 on Thursdays. If that doesn't suit, very happy to arrange a time so you just have to email me. I've set up the unit uh, in a way that I think helps everybody but you'll see that this unit there's a lot of flexibility that we need to work around. You can pretty much do anything you like because what you're doing here is a work-based project a lot of the time. Some people choose not to do a work-based project and to do something that they're interested in but most people will be doing a work-based um, 8,000 word project. You can also negotiate what the, the assessment item, the last, the final task that you submit looks like. You can choose to do the 8,000 worder, which is all together at the end of the semester, or you can choose to separate that out into a smaller research proposal and then a larger um, a final report, I suppose, that you submit at the end of semester. The person that you talked about talk to about those types of things is me. So if you need to negotiate those things, you need to email me, you need to meet face to face or have a chat on the phone and talk about what your assessment's going to look like and how you're going to submit it over the semester. So please get in touch with me as soon as you can if you haven't already done that. I think I have done that with most of you, so I'm pretty sure we're ahead of the game, so to speak. Woohoo! All right. So um, I'm hoping that for those folks who haven't done that, you'll get in touch with me no later than the end of week two, because if you leave it that late, you'll be, you know, you're sort of behind uh, the eight ball, I suppose. So if you haven't got in touch with me, get in touch as soon as you possibly can. Um, just working through. What I, I like to do, if possible, is sort of set you on the right path with some reading material, try and set up a supervisor for you, which I think I've done for, uh, with most of you at this particular point. Um, so yeah, that's why I need you to get in touch uh, as soon as you possibly can. If you're thinking about doing a research project that involves empirical data collection, you definitely need to get in touch with me urgently. Um, because you'll need to go through an ethical clearance process at the university and this can take a while to complete. In fact, it's something you would have already needed to have in progress if you really want to do that and get it all finished in second semester. I think that's it for now. I've got a discussion board up online for you to introduce yourself. So get on in there and tell me about why you're doing this course and why you, uh, what your topic is and introduce yourselves to the um, other students in the unit. That would be fantastic. This is actually a great networking tool and people get to know each other by doing this. So please um, let us all know what you're doing and why you're doing it, etc. I think that's it for now. Have a wonderful week one and if you have any questions in all, at all, don't hesitate to get in touch. Have a great week. See ya!